wanted to show you today is one of my batteries that's actually going bad after, I don't know, maybe 50 charges. It's sort of hard to tell here, but you can see it's actually very badly swollen. Okay, here's a, here's a good one. Here's a bad one, so you can kind of see how inflated this one is compared to this other one. I also have a caliper here. So that's measuring about uh, 31 millimeters, okay? Here's the bad one. Bad one is 39 millimeters, so the really increased in size from 31 to 30, what was it? 39 millimeters, so it increased in size by 8 millimeters. So what I'm going to do next, I'm going to try to open it and see um, if I have one, two or three bad cells. Most likely it's going to be only one, right? So 8 to 5 total voltage, cell number 1 is completely dead, cell number 2 4.06 and number 3 at 4.19. So again, number one, zero volts, number two, three, nine, one, number three, four, point, one, nine. All right, so cell number one is bad. Uh, so basically these two guys here, uh, they measure zero volts. So it's the ground and positive thermal from the first battery. So let's uh, try to gently open up the battery. Obviously you don't wanna uh, pierce the cells so I'm using the smallest uh, scissors I have around the house, laying around the house, and this is actually a small Swiss Army knife. All right, so... Let's see, there's also a second layer of wrapping. So we've got to open it very carefully. Okay, you know what, I'm just going to cut it across. There we go. open it from the break it all the way through. All right. All right. So this is what we have so far. Yeah, this one is pretty bulged and this one doesn't look very good either, so it's only the middle one that actually looks somewhat acceptable. So I'm going to continue to open it here. Alright, so there's lots of packing around it. Alright. So... I think this is, this is the cell that's bad, but I would need uh, a multimeter to confirm that. Yeah, it has to be this one. Remember what I said at the beginning of the video, that it's this wire and the black one, which the two blacks are the same, that this is the bad cell. So my guess right now is that this cell is the bad one. It looks pretty bad too. I got the battery open here and I'm gonna take some measurements. So this would be the first cell, this one right here, and it's also wired, so it corresponds to these two wires. So this is the negative from the first cell and the positive. So here's the wires. This should be almost zero. Oops, I'm blocking the DMM. So look at that. Like 0 0.3 volts. Cell number two, so this is the plus and this is the minus on the second cell. And vice versa, my bad. So cell number two, it's at 4.2 volts. 
four point yeah four point two okay and this is cell number three yeah it's four point two so bottom line is this cell is bad these two are good will I throw this out no because most likely another cell will go bad in one of these other batteries and when that happens I'm gonna take this bad cell and remove it and then take one of the good cells from the other battery and put it here thank you for watching I hope you enjoyed this video if you liked it and found it useful please don't forget to give thumbs up so other youtubers can locate this video and watch it you can also click on any of the images on the screen for more exciting videos from my channel.